When it comes to pitching your pricing to a client, it's completely normal to feel a little bit nervous because you obviously want to make a good impression and show them that your services are worth the investment. In this video, we're going to get your proposal template set up so you can showcase your packages and book clients with confidence. As promised, we have two templates that are plug and play that I'm going to use to demonstrate. The first one is perfect for those of you who offer standard set pricing for your services. And the second one is for all of my business owners who do custom work. We have proposals for everyone. So log into your account now and let's get started. We're going to start with the standard package proposal, which is when you want your client to choose the different services that they want. First, let's change the name at the top by clicking on the pencil icon. I'm going to name mine Coaching Proposal. Just like the contract in the previous video, we'll add your logo at the top first. And now that you've already uploaded your logo to the image library, it's right there ready to go. Then we'll change the name of the proposal section. Click on the pencil icon to rename it. Now for the good stuff. Let's add your packages to this proposal. Click on the first package element here to edit it. Then click the drop down in the menu to the left and you'll see a list of the packages that you've set up already. This is why we created your packages first in the earlier video so that once we got here, you'd already be good to go. You see how that works? Then add the package to this element. Now your package is connected to the select button. We'll repeat these few steps for the other packages as well. If you have any optional add-ons, you can do the exact same thing below. Click on the package element, select your add-on package and put it in. Remember that the term package is just an umbrella term for services and products, and that includes add-ons and a la carte items as well. At the bottom, if you need to ask any additional questions, you can do that here. Because you already learned how the different form elements work, you can customize this proposal to look exactly how you want it. I believe in you. Just don't forget to click save in the top right corner to save your work. That's everything for editing the standard package proposal. Next, we're going to edit the custom package proposal so you can give your clients exactly what they need and still keep everything streamlined in Dubsado. This example is called the custom package proposal. And like I said, it's for those of you who do completely custom work for your clients or offer custom work from time to time. Use the link in the description to copy this proposal to your account first. Once you click on the link, you'll click copy to your account at the top. Same thing as the previous example, change the name of the proposal first and then add your logo. Next, you'll add in your custom package that you made from the packages video earlier. And again, don't forget to click that save button in the top right corner. And that's everything for editing the custom package proposal. That was quick, right? We're coming up on the finish line soon and your Dubsado account is almost client ready. We now have all of the pieces we need to start booking with Dubsado. Now we just have to figure out how to get your proposal, contract and invoice from Dubsado to your client. Come with me to the next video and I'll show you how. I'll see you there.